and the local drug and alcohol rehab facility got the green light from city council to make a move that will continue to allow it to provide all of its services and save some serious bucks. Yeah, we're talking about Senecor, who operates the old Charlie's Place located on McBride. Our Michael Gibson is here now with the tales on this big move, which was a critical issue for the company's CEO, we understand, Michael. Well, that CEO, Bill Bailey, told me today that if council would have turned down his zoning request, the company would have found a way to continue to offer its services here in town, but it would have made it much more difficult as they're operating of that old hotel, which is too large and too costly to continue to operate a business with such a slim profit margin. I'm having a great day. Um, I have one more week to go. I'm really looking forward to it. This therapist is listening to this group of men at the Senecor Drug and Alcohol Rehab Facility. Those suffering from addictions end up here as they try and get their lives back on track. Right now, there's a huge demand for the company's services. A uh, year before last, we were able to serve around 2,400 individuals. This past year, 2,800. And this current year, we're looking to be north of 3,000. But the cost of maintaining this old Ramada Inn Hotel along McBride Lane is still too expensive, according to Bill Bailey, the CEO. The monthly utility bill here is over $20,000. Still, the company looked at renovating the place, and that was also sky high. We were looking at renovation costs to be in north of $8 million. So the company found this old nursing home on Cantwell Lane, but it needed the city to change the zoning. That so it could relocate into this much smaller facility which would still allow it to maintain its operations and even expand in the future if needed. The Corpus Christi uh, zoning regulations require us to have a different type of zoning than a nursing home, where in most communities, behavioral health, health care are all in the same kind of zoning. Council did pass the company's zoning request. The mayor calling it a great move. We're actually reverting the zoning to what it used to be back in the 80s so that we can accommodate this wonderful partner. They've been a partner with the city of Corpus Christi for many years. The company is now looking at starting the renovation work on that nursing home over the next 60 days. The CEO says it's going to take about $3 million to renovate it, and he hopes that work is done by the end of the year. As for that old Ramada Inn Hotel, Mr. Bailey says the company plans on selling the building, and hopefully someone out there is going to be interested in possibly opening it up again as a hotel or some other business.